Welcome to episode 2 of our Anthem of the Seas cruise vlogs. In this episode we experience the highs of the North Star, the lows of the football, the trials and tribulations of trying to book events with the Royal Caribbean app, and we pay our first visits to two of the food venues. Right, so we're going to get the lifts and we're going to go up to deck 15 and try and suss out um, the iFly and the North Star. So, um, there's a zebra with a dress on. Yeah, one isn't it? Some funky art around, yeah. isn't there, Paul? It's black and white and each side of the horse. Uh, a zebra. Uh, sorry about that. <laughs> So, yes, so on the MSC Virtuoso you didn't have to touch the buttons, did you? But you do on here. Yeah. But, um, but you know what day it is, like it's Sunday. Our first day. So here we are, deck 15. Deck 15, North Star that way. Hello! Hello. <laughs> okay, thank you. So we'll walk the other way. <laughs> So here we have this great sight of the North Star. We want to see if we can book ourselves a little flight and also see um, if Paul can book the iFly. So there's a little solarium area by the looks. So let's go out here. So we can take our masks off now because we're outside, which is lovely. And we just have a look at the pool deck. <coughs> There's a nice little pool bar there, look cool. North Star. North Star. Oh, there's a North Star. Oh my God, yes, look. It's up. That's what we want to book. It's the big observation um, capsule that goes up to up to, is it 300 meters? That it goes up above sea level. But yes, yeah, so we want to go and inquire about that, so let's go and do that then, Paulie. North Star, hours of operation. Till quarter past, quarter to seven, nine till eight forty cruising. So here's all the guidelines for it. Yeah, 300, oh, 300 feet, 92 metres. Yeah, 300 metres is quite a bit bigger. Yeah. <laughs> Ignore that bit before. Um, meters, I thought, mm. Maximum rider weight is 300 pounds, so we should be fine. Just? No. Oh well, no. What? You've got to be at least 42 inches, that's 3 foot mm. 6, honey. Will they let I'm you on? 5 foot 1, I'll have you know. Right, so let's go and see how we book onto it. So, do we go up here? Hello, the hell do we book up to going on there? Yeah, we got... Oh, it's raining. <laughs> the guys on the other side. Are they over there? We have to go over that side. Oh, that side. Thank you very much. Oh, it's the spray. Ah, I thought it was the rain. Ah, so here's the desk. So let's just go and find out what we need to do. Yeah. And what we need to do is we've just been chatting to Gary Bembridge on uh, on Instagram. He's actually on the Britannia, which is just down there. So wave. I'm sure he's waving back. Oh, I bet he is. <laughs> so we're just going to find out what we need to do. But look, this is the pod. It's a bit like a London Eye thingy, isn't it? So they're going up now. I'm not very good with heights, so I'm just going to see how I feel all about it. I know. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. So, we've just tried to um, reserve for the North Star, and there are certain slots that are co complimentary, and certain slots you have to pay extra for, which is how much was it? $30. $30. So, we're waiting for a complimentary slot to see just a, a shorter ride, um, but they're updating the app, and you can't book it there so we have to wait for 3 30 get back on the app and see if we can get a complimentary yeah. slot but strangely so, if we want to pay the 30 dollars yes. we can book it now yes i'm not being right. cynical i promise you <laughs> yes. but i have just got on the scales and i'm very pleased to say i should be okay 
for all the outside yeah. activities. So we're just going to go off to the iFly now, which is right at the back of the ship, and see if we can book all these slots in mind. Yes. We've already booked, on the app has been really good actually, we've already booked We Will Rock You. Um, there's a two hour apparently full theatre show, which yes, is one of our favourite musicals ever, Nicole. Yes. We've seen it three times, so we're really excited. I'm getting used to people thinking about it. So, and there's also a show called um, Spectra Cabaret yes. that's in the 270s. So we're going, we've booked for that as well on the app. So um, we want to make sure that we don't miss anything. We've four days. Got so we've got to get it all in. Yes. Um, so we're not we're... here to relax. We're here to <laughs> get everything done. Yeah. So we're going to head down the back of the ship now. So let's go and see if we can book a slot on iFly. Not for me. For Paul. I was going to say we. <laughs> so yeah. And we also sussed out about football. Obviously England are in the final. So Paul was. Uh, We've been to the music hall that's in the pub. Not huge screens around, apart from the, the one on the... Here, yeah, right? but it's going to be a bit eight nippy at 8 o'clock tonight in the English Channel, so... Um, it's very windy. There's a bus there. What's that? Mmm. Just had a couple of beers, mate. <laughs> so here we have the Flow Rider. So they've got like a surfing machine and at the back of here is the iFly, which is the um, skydiving simulator. The Paul's lost. How much pounds have you lost now? 23 pounds. 23 pounds because he really wants to do this. Um, so let's go and see if we can... Uh... Well, that's a flow rider. Is it up? Yeah, so that's the flow rider look. I think he's done that a few times before, hasn't he? Yeah. And that's I the mean, skydiving. I'm in my swimming trunks, so I'd be straight on there now. Would you? No. <laughs> Ooh, what? <laughs> oh, we're getting wet. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> He's throwing water at us, Paulie. Okay, so we can't get to the iFly, so we need to suss out. Yeah, so that's the iFly area there. Maybe we just need to go and sit and look at the app again and see if we can book. You can, mate. So it's. Is it? Well, then, we'll go and speak to him. Don't be shy. Imagine Paulie Morgan being slept shy. Hello. See that man there? So there's ice oil well, there, Paul. Reserve now. It'll only let you reserve if you want to pay, but I don't want to pay. Because you have the complimentary short flights, don't you, apparently? Yes, but they will release this okay. Oh, okay. So we'll just wait for 3.30. What's the time now? Yeah, my watch just died. 3.10, so time Okay, minutes. lovely. Thank you very much. All right, then. Cheers. Okay, can just go around, and then that's the best, okay? Lovely. Yeah, no Thank problem. you. No problem. <laughs> yeah, so again, if you want to pay, we can book now, but we've got a, it's a race, isn't it, Paul? It's a race at 3.30 to get everything booked. So we'll see how successful we're going to be. Right, so after our unsuccessful booking extravaganza, we're going to head back to our cabin. We've decided to see if our cases are there so that we can unpack if we're right because we're towards the back of the ship oh there's our yes that's ours they're here lovely thank you very much oh that's good then Paulie. 
So let's go in and unpack Paul's favourite part of the holiday, isn't it? I love it. He loves it. <laughs> So we're all unpacked and we're getting a bit hungry now, aren't we? So we're gonna, why are you putting your tongue out? You didn't say right then, that's really Don't. disappointing. Well, Go right on. then. So. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna go and find a snack. Um, we're gonna head towards the Cafe Promenade and Sorrento's because we remember from our last Royal Caribbean, they had some lovely snacks in there. They, they, they had cheesecakes on lollipops, didn't they? Lollipop sticks, you mean? Yes, yes, that's right. We seem to be in this sort of twilight zone of everything's about to close up. And because the football's on tonight, we've got to be in certain places at certain times. And we just managed to book the North Star, the North Star, which is the big mechanical arm. And hopefully, it'll coincide perfectly with sail away. So that could be, it could have been totally by mistake. I might add, a master stroke by myself. But trying to fit food in in the main restaurant and football, well, we'll, we'll see how we get on. But if we have a snack for now, yes. that will keep us going. So we're going to head off down to deck four, where uh, uh, Cafe Promenade is. Café Promenade and Sorrento's are nestled together on deck four. Sorrento's is a pizzeria offering pizza and salads and is open from 11am until 3am. Café Promenade offers sandwiches, cakes and cookies, teas and coffees and is open 24 hours a day. The North Star can only be found on Royal Caribbean's Quantum Class ships which are the Anthem of the Seas, the Quantum of the Seas, and the Ovation of the Seas. In non-Covid times, the North Star can accommodate 14 passengers, including a space for one wheelchair user. But due to Covid restrictions, there was just four people and the operator. Even though we weren't very lucky with the weather, the timing of our North Star ride was perfect as it coincided with Sail Away. The one drawback of going on the North Star during Sail Away is it only travels vertically. However, if you ride the North Star during a sea day, not only does it go up 300 feet, it also travels out over the side of the ship. We thoroughly enjoyed our ride on the North Star and even though Carol is extremely scared of heights, she felt safe the whole time. This is definitely a must-do experience. After a fabulous ride on the North Star, we decided to head off for some dinner at one of the main dining rooms. There are two main dining rooms, the American Icon Grill and Silk. And on this particular night, we were seated in Silk. We received excellent service from Jane and Agedi, and this is the menu of what was on offer this evening. So Paulie's got, we've both got French onion soup. I think Paul's gonna... Mm. Oh, look at that. It smells divine. Yeah. Is it? <laughs> oh, mine don't burn. So we've come down to the dining room um, to have uh, our dinner. We tried to book it on the app, but it was all, it looked like we couldn't. So we thought, let's just wander down. And actually, uh, we got into the restaurant with no problem at all. So even if you can't see it on the app, then make sure you come down to the restaurant to speak. And we came straight in, and here we are with the starter. Yes, he was singing. <laughs> Lovely. So there we are, that's, that's our starter, French onion soup. So I've ordered prime rib medium, which look at the size of it falling. It's a big one, isn't it? It is a big one. And look at this knife. How big is this knife? <laughs> and Paul's got, um, what is it, Paul? New York. Yeah. So we must admit the steak beat us, didn't it, Paul? We couldn't eat it all. But <laughs> there's just a little bit of room for I've got New York cheesecake and Paul's got 
not New York cheesecake, I've got royal you've cheesecake. Got royal cheesecake and and you've got, got royal, royal chocolate, chocolate cake. cake. After a delicious dinner, we headed off to find a good seat for the football. Unfortunately, I wasn't smiling quite as much as this two hours later. But hey, first final in my lifetime, so onwards and upwards. Join us in episode 3, where there's more food, we explore the casino and the pool decks, we enjoy one of the best shows we've ever seen at sea, and find out why Carol is so impressed with Royal Caribbean toilets. And if that isn't enough to make you come back for episode 3, then I don't know what is. Thanks for watching. For more cruise content from Paul and Carol, watch one of these videos next.